intergenerational space, specifically in a way that encourages the emergence of young women's leadership within the context of social movement and social justice. So that's one of the reasons we thought this space was important. And, and I will let my co-facilitator introduce himself. Um, they've been, they're, they're not staff at the Girls Action Foundation, but they're family to us and they've been for many years, so. Hi, uh, I'm Christine McKenzie, and I've worked in collaboration with the Girls Action Foundation for for five years, something like that, um, specifically around developing training and resources uh, for women who want, or women or older girls who want to lead programs for girls. Hi, my name is Kat. Um, I worked with Girls Action Foundation for three years um, in various capacities, and uh, I do facilitation with them sometimes um, on contractors. I have any, like, are you going to do an introduction to Girls Action? A little later. <coughs> later, yeah. later, okay, so we'll talk a bit more about what Girls Action does as an organization later. Um, but for now, I think we're going kind of, to jump into the objectives of the session. And then what we'll be doing a couple of exercises, just working through kind of um, really appreciating the different perspectives that different generations bring to organizers. So that's what we're going to be doing today, is kind of having those discussions. It's, kind of, it's a pretty light workshop. Like, there can be like moments, but usually they're pretty positive moments, and so just to let you know what's in store for the next little while. Uh, yeah. Okay, so the general objectives of, of the workshop is actually an appreciated inquiry moment about intergenerational space. The assumption is we've all worked in these spaces, we've all created them unconsciously or consciously, and it's to bring a, a sense of awareness of how we did that, um, so that it can be done in a more conscious way in the future around creating those spaces where generations can work together. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk a little bit about Girls Action Foundation a little later about our objectives, and we also have some literature, um, one of which is Building Bridges, which is about creating intergenerational space, which uh, I brought it, I think, in a copy so everybody can take a copy, even one in French, a couple in French. So we're going to start with the first session. I'm going to let Kat introduce them. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we're going to start out by um, kind of taking a moment to break into generational groups. So usually we do this workshop with a few more people, but we can make it work with the numbers that we have. So what I'm going to ask you to do first off is to kind of sit next to maybe like in little groups of three or whatever, people who are in an age bracket of your age, so within about 10 years. So usually sometimes we have like a group of like under 20s, a group of 20s, a group of 30s, a group of 40s, a group of 50s, or depending on the group kind of, sometimes you do like a 40 plus, or do you do like elders, so kind of depending on how things go how the groups break up. So whatever age you get to right? whatever and this is whatever age you get to you know, like people born. This is whatever you're identifying. Yes. Yeah, totally. <laughs> Self-identified age, if you will. Um, Do we have part? We have people thirty and under? Okay, so if you can group yourself here, everybody who's yeah. thirty and under. Yeah, so that's perfect. Um, folks in their 30s, 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 